Hey guys, what's up? In this game, I'll be using the least favorite fighter. And he is none other than the ex-leader of Smiths of the Monian Empire, Terizla. He was once in the limelight and even used on the MPL way back season 4. What can you say about that, Terizla? <laughs> History has long forgotten me. I hope you can take comfort from your cherished memories. Revenge Anyways, I suggest that you level up his second skill first because this can deal a decent damage on the early game. Then put the stat on your first skill next, but don't forget to prioritize your ultimate if available. First blood. Revenge has consumed me. Light. You can also use your second skill to easily clear a minion wave. Teresla's first skill has three effects. First is the 30% slow on the first target it hits. Next is Teresla's movement speed will increase when the skill hits an enemy. The last one is after 3 seconds. The marked enemy will receive an explosion damage. I guess the explosion damage is enough to kill you, Zong. <laughs> In this game, I'll be using the emblem Festival of Blood to enhance Teresla's sustainability together with this item build. The world Initiate retreat. In darkness. For the battle spell, I use Flicker to compensate for the lack of gap closing ability that can be useful in key fights. Done here, back to my lane. Aside from Flicker, you can also An use Purify when facing enemy lineups that have a lot of crowd control heroes. I just got my Bloodlust apps that will improve my spell vamp by 20%. It also has additional attack and 10% cooldown reduction. Teresla is a fighter who uses skills to attack his opponents. It means that he needs spell vamp to regenerate his HP. Has consumed me. Let's try to kill Yu Zong again. And he flew away. An enemy has been slain. Hey Saber, can you please help me destroy this tower? Okay, I got this. Just a little bit more. Replenish my mana. The world enshrouded in darkness. An enemy has been slain. Light. 
Killing spree. I just got my Queen Swings, a defense item that complements Tilly's less durability. It also has a cooldown reduction and additional spell trap. My next item is War Axe, a great equipment for additional damage and cooldown reduction. So what can you say about this forgotten executioner? Will you use him? Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. That's all for this video. Stay safe and thank you for watching.